Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Shanice. Welcome. Today's video is going to be a makeup get ready with me. And I'm going to be taking my face from this to this. So if you're interested in seeing this video and me telling you the products that I use and some techniques, all that good stuff, then just continue watching. So yeah, y'all, as always, all the products that I mentioned in the video will be listed down below in the description box. Also, don't forget to follow me on all my other social media platforms at IamNiceJ underscore. So to start off, I'm just filling in my brows very lightly. I don't go too heavy on my brows because nowadays I've been going for more of a lighter look. So I'm just going to fill in both brows very lightly. So once I'm done filling them in, I'm going to take a little bit of concealer and just sharpen the bottom, outlining it a little bit, just making sure it's nice and crisp. And that they look very neat and nice underneath. Now I'm going to go in and apply my moisturizer slash primer, which is the Bobbi Brown Enriched Face Base. So today, y'all, I don't know, it was just calling my name and I'm glad I picked it because it was just given. Like my skin felt so smooth, so soft. Between this and the Charlotte Tilbury moisturizer, I don't know which one is better. I can't pick, but the two of them, y'all, try it out. Now I'm going to go in and apply my foundation. As you guys can see, I couldn't decide if I need to add a little bit more, but I ended up doing it anyway. And then I'm going to go ahead and just blend it out really well. And then after I blend it out with the brush, I'm going to go in with my beauty blender and just reinforce the foundation and blend it out a little bit more. <laughs> Oh, so yeah, before I go in with the beauty blender, I like to take a smaller brush to blend out my forehead just so I don't mess up my lace or get the foundation too much in my hair and stuff. So I just use a really small brush to go in and blend that out.
So y'all, y'all still see me applying my concealer and stuff and blend it out, but I just ended up going back in and applying a little bit more right underneath the eyes just to give me a little bit more coverage. Now I'm going in with these triangle powder puffs from Amazon and I'm going to apply my setting powder under my eyes, my eyelids, basically everywhere where I put concealer, I'm going to set it with the powder puff. So for my eyes today, I use this palette from Nabla Cosmetics and I'm just going to take those two brown colors and I'm going to put the lighter one in my crease and then go back in with the darker one to just deepen it up and put that all over my eyelids. So once I'm finished with the eyes, I'm just going to go back in to finish up my face. I'm going to bronze, put some blush on, and I'm also going to be trying out this, I don't even know what to call it. It's like a highlighter bronzer mixed together from Fenty Beauty. I had it for a while, you guys, and I just had it in a drawer, and today I decided to take it out and give it a little try. I don't really highlight my face like that anymore, but this is different. It like gives like, how can I explain it? It gives like golden, like bronze not really like too much shimmer but just bronze y'all gonna see y'all gonna see in a second Okay, y'all, so this is what I was talking about. So it actually broke in the packaging when it was shipped to me, which is another story for another day. But look at how it looks, y'all. So it's like a highlighter, but it has bronzer in it as well. Y'all see what I was trying to say? So yeah, I'm just going to apply a little bit of that to just give me a little bit of a glow. And yeah. So I always set my face twice. I'm going to go in for the first time right here before I do all my eye stuff. And then once I'm done, I'm going to go back in and set it one final time.
So once I apply my lashes, I like to use a black liquid liner just to line the top of it because it helps the lash band blend in with your eyes a little bit more. I always do this. No matter what makeup look I'm doing, I always do this because I just like the way it makes my eyes look. It just makes everything look very seamless and very nice. I also go in on my waterline with a black eyeliner. So I'm wiping off the lip mask that I had on while I was doing my makeup and I'm going to take the beauty blender just to apply a little bit of foundation that's left on it onto my lips to mute everything out and just make it one solid color. And then I'm going to go on with my brown lip liner and line my lips and then I'll put on my lip gloss after. I think this lip combo that I did today was so cute. I usually do the same lip combo all the time but I want to switch it up a little bit and I love how it came out. So this is the second and final time that I'm setting my makeup and this is going to be it. I'm just going to dry it down with my little handheld fan y'all that I love so much. And in a second you guys will see the end results. So yeah y'all this is how the makeup turned out. I really really loved it. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video.